I was just going through this old hard drive here on my laptop and I completely forgot I'd made this video. It's pretty embarrassing. I'm gonna go and get myself a day plan. When I had the Canon R5 for testing and reviewing, I made three videos with it. There was a general walk around video, a landscape photography video, and a bird and wildlife video. But on that afternoon that I took the Canon R5 out to do that landscape photography video, I completely forgot earlier that day, I'd taken the camera to a seaside location here, and I ended up getting some stills and video of some kite surfers in action. So that footage had got mixed up with the landscape photography video that I'd ticked off as done. The reason I stumbled across this footage now is because I was having a bit of a play with some Canon R5 RAW files, doing some bird shots up in Photoshop, and I found the kite surfing shots in another folder. Oh well, better late than never. Here's this little video I made using the Canon R5. Now all the stills you're gonna see are straight out of the camera. And the video is 4K 120 frames per second, filmed in the camera, and it's all handheld. It was perfect conditions on this day for kite surfing, and there was even a sailing regatta happening. So lots of action to capture with the Canon R5. I was using the Canon R5 in conjunction with an adapted Canon EF 100-400mm f4.5-5.6 L2 IS USM lens. This sequence here of this kite surfer coming straight at me, I think shows the impressive focusing ability of the R5. It never dropped a frame focus wise in the burst of shots I took. Guys, thank you so much for watching. I was super impressed by that Canon R5 and its amazing focusing abilities when I had it. Not to mention the stabilization while using it handheld for video. I came very, very close to buying this camera for myself. And it will be very interesting when the Canon EOS R1 and EOS R5 Mark II eventually come out. Now we were expecting to see those cameras this year sometime. But I've heard a whisper now that they are delayed until 
next year. So fingers crossed I get those cameras to review on my channel as well. Anyway, take care and I'll see you next time.